Hi, Discount Promo team. I wanted to congratulate you on the reviews that you have with this listing. I know how competitive this category can be on Amazon, so to see the ratings that you have is really a job well done. Now, my job is to look for potential opportunities with sellers who prioritize on Amazon. And if it's okay with you, I'd like to show you a module that you have for this listing that takes up a ton of real estate and you're not utilizing it, along with a couple of other things I noticed. My name is Sean and I'm with my Amazon guy. So listen, I'll pack this full of valuable information. It's gonna drive more sales. I'll get to that module in just a minute. But first thing, let's take a look at your keywords. So we utilize this tool to look at your keywords, at your competitors' keywords. And I see that your sponsored and organic are here. You've got 674 sponsored, 2,359 organic. Now looking at your competitors, I'll tell you both these numbers are kind of low. Um, and I'm curious when you've updated your listing, right, to update the keywords that are in your listing. So I sorted this by, and real quick, sorry, we do recommend a one to two ratio. So for every one sponsored, you have two organic. Um, but scrolling down, I did sort your keywords by the most frequently clicked on. And I'm going to get out of the way here and show you something. So <clears throat> You see, we've got wedding decorations, bachelorette party favors, wedding favors. These all make sense that you would rank for that. I don't see you there. Party favor adults, right? You should be there. Bachelor party, party favor. You should be there too as well. Here we go. Can cooler. Look at your organic rank though. It's so high. Custom, it's high. Koozies, eh, could be better. Um, Frost Buddy, Koozies in bulk. Well done on that organic rank. I would work on the sponsored rank too as well. Bridal, I mean, there's, a, look at it. There's so many options here where you're not ranked and you should be. Um, interesting. Oh, nice. Well done on Koozie there. So, but for the most part, your organics are in need of work, right? <clears throat> Let's explore this a little bit further. So here we go all the way down here. For Can Koozie, 2,400 people are looking for Can Koozie on Amazon this month alone, and you're organically ranked 123. So that means that you've got all these sponsored ads that are showing up before yours and the 122 other organic ads. That's over $12 million a year, just a million dollars this month alone, $1.2 million. So where you're organically ranked, it's going to be very hard for you to get your share of this revenue. And you and I both saw your organics and your keywords just in general need to improve. Now coming over here, I found this listing by taking custom can coolers out of your title, found this listing here. Now I'm not doing any product comparisons. What I want to show you is this they are advertising and they've got the perfect ratio of organics to, to sponsor keywords. They have been updating their organics too as well. This is why they're selling more than you. Um, this listing in and of itself, they, they show up in over 4,000 different search variations. So that they have a broader um, exposure, broader exposure than you do. You're only showing up in 3,500 different search variations. So uh, definitely room for improvement there. Now, let me show you something that we do in phase three of our three phase SEO process. So looking at those keywords where you're ranked in spots 20 through 50, Wow, right now you've got 585 of them. And because of your organic rank, you're really not benefiting from that traffic. So our focus would be to lift you up in the ranks so that instead of being in spot 37 or 42 for koozies or koozie, we'd have you in the top 10. And imagine, right? that traffic that you would receive. This just proves that your organics need to be optimized. Now let's talk about the fun stuff coming over here to your listing. So I went through the images. I love the fact that you've got all of these infographics. They're wonderful. I do recommend replacing one of them with video and having a lifestyle image, at least one image with a person in it, looking at the camera. Um, you know, who's your demographic? Who is that person? It's all walks of right, life, right? So really, um, I would just put one lifestyle image in there with someone looking at the camera. It creates a connection, believe it or not, with the consumers when they're on your listing. Um, your title looks short. Yeah, that's what I thought. You've got 126 characters. You've got room for 75 more characters here 
it can go up to 200 characters. This is where Amazon looks to first for your organic keywords, and then they come down to your about this item section. So I would take these bullets that are a little short and increase the content. You can go up to 250 characters within each bullet. Again, that's also where Amazon looks for your organic keywords, the two first spots. Now, let me show you that module that you have, but you're not utilizing. So if you do anything today, please do this. Log into Seller Central and just above product description, you see a brand story. That's where you can put your you know, brand logo, talk about how you got your start, why you do what you do, what makes you so unique and special. You can even include a hyperlink to your brand store. Um, now I'm going to look, I love that you've got A plus content, but you're not using your alt text properly. You should be using these for words that are most frequently clicked on. Koozie, 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 different spellings of koozie. Absolutely. You need to do that. All of your alt text. Oh goodness. Now I do like the product grid that you have down here. So well done on that. Listen here at my Amazon guy, we are a 225 person agency. We manage uh, over 200 brands, giving our clients peace of mind, knowing that Amazon is handled so that they can focus on their business. But I'd love that opportunity to chat with you. So go ahead and click the link in my email that reads book a call, snag yourself a free consultation. And then once you do that, I'll email out that competitor analysis. But thanks so much for watching. Look forward to speaking with you soon. Take care.